If you're looking to enhance your internet browsing speed, privacy, or security, changing your DNS server is an effective step. Windows 11 offers two simple ways to do this, and in this guide, I'll show you exactly how it works. DNS stands for Domain Name System. It's like the phone book of the internet, translating website names into IP addresses so your computer's browser can access them. Two of the best free DNS providers are Cloudflare and Google. Here are their DNS addresses for both IPv4 and IPv6. Let's start with the first method, using the control panel. Follow these steps carefully. Click the search bar and type control panel. Open the control panel and set the view to category. Then click network and internet followed by network and sharing center. On the left, select change adapter settings. Here you'll find all your network connections like Wi-Fi and ethernet. Right click on your active connection and select properties. For me, it's Wi-Fi. In the list, find internet protocol version four. Select it and click properties. For this video, I'll be using Google's public DNS server addresses. Switch the option from obtain DNS server address automatically to use the following DNS server addresses. Under preferred DNS server, use 8.8.8.8. .8 and under alternate DNS server, use 8.8.4.4. .8 After that, click OK to close the menu. Now, scroll down to Internet Protocol version 6. Make sure it's enabled with a check mark. Select it and click Properties. Copy and paste the respective preferred and alternate DNS server addresses from Google's website. Click OK to save your settings. And that's all for method one. Now, let's try the second method using the settings app. Open the Windows search bar, type settings, and click on the app. Navigate to network and internet. For ethernet, click ethernet and look for IP assignment. Then click edit. But since I'm using Wi-Fi, I'll select Wi-Fi and then hardware properties. On the DNS server assignment, I'll click edit. The first thing is to change from automatic to manual and enable IPv4 and IPv6. Now all that's left to do is fill in Google's respective DNS server addresses for IPv4 and IPv6. Once you've entered the addresses, hit save, and that's it. To ensure your new DNS settings are working correctly, go to start and type command prompt. Open it and type ipconfig forward slash all. Hit enter. In here, check the DNS server entries for your active internet connection. If you found this video helpful, leave a like and subscribe.